Use of lifting system for dumper. Lift up. Start engine to make system pressure reach the required working pressure, about 0.8 MPA. Step on clutch pedal. Firstly, turn on power takeoff select switch, and then turn on power takeoff switch. Shift transmission into second. Control engine speed between 1000 RPM to 1500 RPM. Release the clutch pedal. Hydraulic oil pump will get to work. Tip tilter back to set angle, and it will automatically open after touching the limit valve or the relief equipment inside oil cylinder. Here, the tilter stops at the biggest angle to dump cargo. During the lifting and lowering process, you can stop the tilter at desired angle by switching the operating valve to neutral position. Lower switch operating valve to lowering position. Tilter begins to lower. After touching the limit valve, the tilter has fallen to the lowest position. Due to tilter is heavier, switch operating valve to slow lowering position. The tilter will be lowered slowly. After the tilter falling back to its original position, step on clutch pedal. Turn off power takeoff switch and power takeoff select switch in turn. Shift transmission into neutral position and release clutch pedal. You'd better lift tilter up when transmission is in first or second gear and engine speed is between 1000 RPM to 1500 RPM. Lifting the tilter up in third or fourth gear is allowed. However, the engine speed must be between 800 RPM to 1000 RPM. Before a vehicle is running, you must check whether power takeoff switch has turned off. It is forbidden for using power takeoff when vehicle is running. Place operating valve handle to lower position when driving. When heavy load, do not lift tilter up when the back door is closed, otherwise it will cause rollover. When offloading cargo, you should park vehicle on flat and firm ground. Transfer slope will lead to vehicle rollover to one side, and longitudinal slope will cause vehicle head off road surface. Pay attention to the height to avoid collision.